Lumiere 3D is an incredible AI platform that helps businesses effortlessly create captivating cinematic videos for e-commerce and marketing purposes. With its dynamic camera movements, lifelike 3D scanning, AI-generated music, and breathtaking scenes, it takes your content to the next level. Turn ordinary objects into breathtaking 3D masterpieces with our revolutionary AI scanning technology. Before we show you how it works, please subscribe to this channel and hit the bell notification icon. Let me show you how Lumiere 3D works. Just create your account and now it is time to take some photos. You can use some white papers so that create a contrast between my product and the background. One key element to keep in mind when you're taking photos of your product to have a strong contrast between your background and your product your ground where your table has to be free of any patterns and as you take your photo you have to make sure that the entire product is in the frame and when you take your photos make sure you follow a consistent arch create that consistency in perspective. And this is going to help in creating a better 3D model and as you capture your photos make sure that you can overlap those photos and this is going to help the algorithm create the 3D model again and you can repeat this process taking the photos in that arch sort of structure by taking multiple angles of the product you can lay on its side backwards sideways and this will help you capture the product in all possible angles so you can get a more realistic 3D model and in terms of lighting soft consistent lighting is best avoid spotlights avoid hard shadows on the product and if you have a light box or just an overall softer lighting source that will help in generating a better 3D model. You can shoot any of your product from smartphone to shoes, let your products shine with visually stunning cinematic product videos. Once you've captured all your photos just transfer all of the photos into your computer and then we'll go into Lumiere 3D. Interface of this app is very simple and easy to use. You can see lots of professional themes here. You can see some are free and some are premium. You can unlock these premium themes by getting early access, which is about $29 right now. And I believe I'll also be leaving a link in the description below if you want to get some discount in your purchase with Lumiere 3D. So first, go to Models to create 3D model. Keep in mind that you can submit minimum of 100 photos. Usually the more photos you use the more accurate model you receive. You can upload up to 300 photos with a resolution limit of up to 4095px. Simply upload your model photos. It will take some time depend on size and internet speed. You can see it looks pretty good. You can move it around with your mouse and rotate it and see how much detail you are able to get. Now go to templates and there are free templates and you can access the free ones. You can choose anyone and see preview. Once you like, simply click on Customize Templates. You can see we don't have our own product here. So the way we can do that is go to our models and select our shoe goes back to projects. You can see that our boot has been selected. You can see that there are three light sources here in this template in this video and they are the circles and there is that camera on the corner. On the bottom right corner you get to see what the camera is actually looking at. You could do edit camera and light position. With this you can also control the position of your lights and of that camera if you double click on the camera you can control the different axis set Y X A I S and the rotation of that camera and you get a preview in the bottom right corner of the screen. So this is what the camera will look like at this point in time and if you scroll to the beginning of that clip you're able to see that shot looks like in the beginning and you can go ahead and adjust some of those camera movements. So let's that shot has been changed like that. Let's go to this clip to see how you can adjust that lighting. So you can double click on this light by dragging the diamond, here you're able to make the light source larger if you drag it up or smaller, if you drag it down you can adjust the position of that lighting as well so you can hold and drag and then you can see the lighting position is changing in the bottom right corner in the preview of that clip. If I move that light over here and rotate it so if you wanted to get rid of any of adding and deleting shots, backgrounds the shots you can just Go into the options over here for each of the shots and then just delete it or you can even duplicate it. If you wanted to add a new shot you can click on the plus sign and look at some of the shot templates over here so there are close-ups and these are all the different types of close-ups. There are also long shots, wide shots and medium shots. So let's try adding this green one. You can see this is what it looks like. Change the background so here under backgrounds, there are these options right now so let's just select galaxy and then we click on play so that's what that shot looks like rendering. 
Once you're okay with your video you can go and click render and select your frame rate either 30 frames per second or 60 frames per second if you wanted to export this in a vertical format you can also select that and you can select to export in your desired resolution full HD 1080p. Once you're done that you can click on render. The cool thing about this is that it'll render directly on the web browser so there's no need for you to download anything into your computer. Once it's finished rendering you can go into your renders tab and select what you have just rendered and now you can download it into your computer. Product link is mentioned in the description and don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit the bell notification icon for more product review videos.